I'm not frightened of Luis Lopez Fitzgerald. The new alarm is simply to better protect the families and um, Ethan's best interests. <laughs> I knew the E word would get your attention. I will not allow you or Alistair to jeopardize Ethan's future. Well, then you should consider firing Pilar. Having her around here makes me nervous. What if she starts looking for proof that we cranes had something to do with Martin's disappearance? Pilar would never do that. And what if she did, Julian? What would she find, hmm? The women around here are trying to kill me. <laughs> oh. Is there any way we can speed up the process? Here's a list of corporate gifts that need to go out post-haste. Pretend that you're my dutiful wife. Take care of them. Pilar. Mr. Crane? Pilar, I'm glad you're here. Close the door. So, Pilar, mm -hmm. do you realize what went on in this room last night? Yes, Julian saw Sheridan and Louise kissing. Well, what do you make of that? Well, I can only tell you what Sheridan told me. She says that the only feelings she has for Louise are those of gratitude for saving her life. Yeah, I thought it was probably something like that. But since Louise put Julian on notice that he's going to get to the bottom of Martin's disappearance, Julian considers any relationship between Sheridan and Louise a threat to the family. The only relationship I see as a threat to the Cranes is the one that you are intent on rekindling with Sam Bennett. I know, I know, but I can't help it. I love Sam, and I always will. Then love him from afar. Nothing good can come from dredging up the past. Can't you see that this is madness? <laughs> what I see is an empty, loveless existence without Sam in it. He's the key to my happiness, right or wrong, immoral or not. That's the way it is. You're beyond reason. Let's not talk about Sam. I'm, I'm sorry, I know it upsets you. I didn't want to do that. I have to go out and do some shopping for Julian. While I'm out, just be careful of this new laser alarm. I don't know what is in that safe, but whatever it is, Julian is hell-bent on protecting it.